channel i as you can tell i'm in a completely different setup i am currently in cardiff i don't know if it's ready up but i'm planning fingers crossed i don't know if this is gonna happen to sort of like a cardiff get ready for me so you probably already know that if that's ready up but yeah we just come for a short getaway in cardiff i know not everyone's gonna agree with this however we have made sure to take every precaution we would normally go up by train to somewhere like cardiff and it's quite far for me to drive however we drove today which is the longest journey i've ever done i'm actually really proud of myself it took about two and a half hours which for some people is probably really short but considering i'm only really used to driving from my house to my local city which is about a half an hour drive. It was a really long drive for me, so I'm really proud of myself, if I'm honest. But yeah, we've just come here for a two night getaway. We're staying in an Airbnb, so we're not gonna be in close contact with many people. And then when we do go out, we'll make sure to wear masks and sanitize and all the things like that. So yeah, I thought I'd give you a little Airbnb tour because this is a beautiful flat if you're looking to come to stay at Cardiff. I'll leave a link to it down below if you are interested. So you can get it if you want, but yeah, I'll show you what the flat looks like here as you can see and then we've got like a little shoe rack which obviously we've got our shoes on and i put our masks by the floor so we don't forget them when we go out and then a little sign saying welcome and then here we have the bathroom which i'll put the toilet seat down that is not very nice for you to see but yeah it's just a little bathroom which obviously is all we need a little mirror sink and place to get two brushes of soap Another extra toilet roll with a shower and a bathtub, which is really, really nice for our money. We pay £65 a night for this, which I think is amazing. And then this is the smaller of the two bedrooms, which we're gonna like sort of use as like a spare room storage room. But yes, I just love this interior. As you know, my favorite color is yellow and it's all yellow themed, which is so nice with a really nice, decent full size mirror here as well. And a little bench, just put a garble game on it. And then if you come along the corridor, which is by the front door, you have the bigger of the two bedrooms. It's quite dark in here because the um, it doesn't have much light. It only goes out to the bin area. But it's just, again, yellow and black, which is just... I just like, love this interior. <laughs> With another really nice full-size mirror and a double wardrobe. Probably won't really use the wardrobes very much as we're only here two nights. Have a little bench. And this is a, a view of the main room. It is so beautiful. I can't actually go over how nice this place is. This is exactly how I deck out my house. And then if we come through here, we have the lounge. Chris is watching some game show. Is that dog on it? Awkward. <laughs> and then here we have the kitchen, which is just... I just, I, they've just done so well the space and the interior is beautiful. So yeah, we filled the fridge with some bits. So I'll do a little tiny fridge tour. There's only really, really like snacky bits. We've got, we went to m &S, as you can probably tell. We've got a couple of desserts. So we've got brambled apple turnovers and passion fruit Swiss roll, which sounded, Swiss roll, which sounded really nice. There's flip white chocolate, white fudge, um, plated pretzels, which are one of my favorites. And everyone's talking about these at the moment, which is the gigantic button. So I'd have to pick some of them up. Some fountains, some really nice shortbread, and then some fruit down here. So we've got some bananas, candy floss grapes, which is if you haven't tried, you have to. And a pallet of strawberries. And then we've got some eggs, because I feel like you have to get eggs when you go somewhere. And then we've got um, some milk, this iced coffee latte we saw in M&S. Tango, and this bottle of never heard of it it's an alcoholic drink so if you're ever under the age of 18 um not naughty if you're drinking this <laughs> this is cranberry juice orange juice and peach flavors with vodka which i just found thought sounded quite nice and then we've got some more snacks up here oh i didn't actually realize how much did these come with it the unicorn cakes did mum bring them oh we've got some little angel cakes some porridge in case we find so many different breakfast, chocolate pancakes, apple rings, which are one of my favourites, fox biscuits, um, these dark chocolate biscuit things which we like, and popcorn. And then finally, I think there's some stuff in this cupboard. We just have like breakfast stuff. So we've got a pancake shaker. For... <laughs> just drop the pancake. Um, I don't actually know how you do this. Do you just add water or add milk? Just add water. So that'll be easy. And then we got some toppings for that. So we just got Biscoff and I will probably have, oh, sorry. Biscoff and I have that with um, banana. And Chris will probably have chocolate, uh, Nutella and 
strawberries so yeah that is the flat today i doubt we'll really do overly much because it isn't actually great weather out might have a little pot outside but i don't know yet we'll order takeaway in tonight because delivery obviously delivered because it's a big city but yeah i think that's everything i'll do you want if i do something else i'll make sure to let you know but for now that's it hello i haven't actually got that much to update you on <laughs> secret I was today has just been a chill day, however. We are currently watching The Kissing Booth 2. I've seen a lot of people talking about it at the moment. We did watch the first one when it first came out. I don't know if you can see. I've got my phone camera on, but it's there. But it's just, it's so nice to be in a different location. So if you were thinking of going away, I'd say I'd highly recommend it. Obviously, being careful is important. But I really, I'm really enjoying it. And we're getting wagon mummers in a bit. So I'll make sure to show you that. But yeah. Loving life. I am honestly the world's worst YouTuber, but I had my katsu curry and chili squid and it was so good. If I remember, I'll add a picture here, but I completely forgot to vlog it because if I'm honest, I was really hungry. However, I wasn't too impressed. Obviously, I've used it over a few times and I never had an issue. However, when our katsu curry arrived, like all the sauce had leaked all over the paper bag. So like I had less sauce, which was a bit of a pain, but oh well. But I'm in the master bedroom and honestly, this made me realise how I want my interior when I move out. This is exactly what I want, like yellow and green. Honestly, beautiful. But yeah. Also, another thing, found a wrap by the bins. And I, as a, I don't know, I don't live in a city, so um, tell me if I'm wrong. But I feel like rats are quite common in cities. Um, but yeah, we'll tell our Airbnb people because I don't actually know if it is or not. But yeah, we honestly love it here. We went for a short walk around the like, streets around here we sort of live in a more like um residential area instead of like in the inner city like by the hotels so it's a little park near us which is really really cute but yeah but this evening we're just gonna play some board games watch the films um we watched finished watching the kissing booth which was so good i actually loved it i watched the first one as i said a while ago and i didn't remember enjoying it have i really enjoyed the second one so i'm gonna have to watch the first one to see what i was on about yeah i am gonna get into my pajamas maybe have a bath or a shower because we have a bathtub here and yeah play some board games i'll try and remember to film it but if not i'll probably pick this up before to bed or in the morning because tomorrow is our full day here We're spending two nights here so we have one like whole day and the mini golf course has opened which if you watched my cardiff vlog about a year or so ago we went to the mini golf it's like an event i don't know what it's called but it's really cool it's at the top of the um, shopping center and that's recently opened again obviously with all restrictions in place and social distancing and everything like that but yeah we're, that's like one of our favorite things to do when we're here so i'm so happy that we're able to do that so yeah i'm not really doing much today i feel like i'm just talking waffle this whole time so I'm gonna get into my pajamas and play some ball games and drink some more of that peach on the beach because it's actually really good. And I never drink alcohol, honestly, like never. And I'm gonna carry on waffling for a bit, to be honest. I'm not driving back tomorrow, so like it's not like I'm gonna be a bit hungover, even though I probably won't be because I'm not drinking very much. But we're going back on the Wednesday, so I won't drink tomorrow night. And then I'll be fine to drive before anyone comments about me driving after having alcohol. I am not driving tomorrow whatsoever. We're walking everywhere and if we do go and if we do decide to get in a car wearing masks, all of that, I think that, that bit of peach and beach I had has gone to my head, hence why I have just been waffling for three minutes. Yep, sorry for wasting your time. <laughs> I'm as I said the worst vlogger ever. I haven't vlogged anything really from today, especially this evening. But all we did was play some board games. We played, it's called Five Second Rule, which is quite fun. And now we're in bed. The beds are actually okay. Like obviously they're not gonna be anything special, but they're okay. And the lighting in here is perfect for like YouTube lighting, because I don't know if you can tell, but it's like white bulbs, which I personally prefer warm bulbs because I think it's quite cozy. However, these are good for filming. I've just realized I've been talking so much waffle this whole time. We're talking about light bulbs and I don't know, I even know what's to quote on the other one, but yeah, hopefully this vlog picks up because otherwise this isn't even going to make it to YouTube because it's incredibly boring, but yeah, I'm going to go to bed now and I'll see you in the morning for a full day of card. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good night. Morning, I'm not going to show my face as I have just woken up. Chris is on pancakes today, so... 
Here is my pancake. I have got baseball and banana and he's going to have 10 strawberries. I cut up the fruit, so I did have a slight bit of help. But yeah, this is our breakfast. Okay, so it's now a little bit later on and we're about to head into town. I thought I'd do a quick OTD, but I've gone for a bit of a more like out there outfit for me and I probably won't even end up going out in this because one, I don't think it looks right and two, I'm just not confident enough to wear something like this. But yeah, I'll show you what I'm wearing and then we'll head out the door. Well, I'm in such a weird mood these last few days. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, so I have got a scrunchie in as always. This is a grey one from Amazon, my best friend Caitlin got it for me. Phone case, which I thought I could have a little mention, is from the Soph Does Life Skinny Dip range, and I'm honestly obsessed. It's so nice, it's like holographic. I don't think you can tell in the mirror. Oh no, you can. Then I've got a little white top, which says Monte Carlo, Monaco, which is from PLT. I've got my denim jacket on, which doesn't actually go with my jeans, but I don't have any other jackets, and it's not actually that nice out. And my denim jacket's from Topshop got a belt on which is from Stradivarius but it's just like a black belt I get quite a lot of questions on this I think it's because it's like it's got quite a nice detail but yeah Stradivarius got a while ago now and just some blue I think they're mom jeans slightly baggy jeans from Topshop again and then I'll wear it with my Nike Air Forces as usual however they've got holes in them so bad so I'm going to look in like office and show and stuff today so I can get a new pair because Every time I walk in a puddle or even on like the tiniest of wet surface, my socks get soaking. But yeah, I think that's everything I have to tell you. I just don't think this goes, does it? I don't think I can make this work. But I might have to put a hoodie on. I really want to though, because you don't care, do you? <laughs> See you in a bit. I've opted to put a hoodie on. Don't think you care. But I really don't like this outfit. Like, what am I wearing? But we're just going to the city centre. I'm not going to see anyone in there. We are above his James and Karis. Don't think that's going to happen. Enough of me rambling because I've done this the whole vlog. Let's go play some crazy golf. Crazy golf. Crazy, crazy, crazy golf. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Crazy, crazy, crazy golf. Being the indecisive Nelly I am, I've got changed again. The only thing different I'm wearing is the shorts. And these are like my favourite shorts ever. They're from Misguided. They're like such a nice length. They're in tall, and I'm not tall. I'm like five foot five, five foot six. So if you want like shorts which genuinely do cover your bum like really well, I do recommend these because they're just cool. Like they've got the threads that hang down. Yeah, Misguided, tall, black. Jeannie shorts. <laughs> Off we go and take three. <laughs> Um, we have just got back and ordered Taco Bell because we can't get Taco Bell where we are so we're making the most of it. I got a quesadilla meal, Chris got a volcano burrito and yeah, it smells so good. Hello. Uh, long time no talk. I am honestly so bad at vlogging, but I really wanted to show you my trip to Cardiff because a lot of you, you people like when I do my vlogs, like I vlog Milan, I vlog Cardiff, so I probably will be uploading this. So we're back at the flat, which we have been for ages, and we're watching our faves, the Sakoni Jolies. We love the Sakoni Jolies. And our Nandos is on its way, so yeah. Okay, so our Nandos has now arrived. I'll show you what we've got. I've got a chicken wrap, lemon and herb with mash and broccoli and Chris got a chicken bag with mash but this is so different for me normally I literally just get butter chicken and chips or like chips and broccoli but yeah we watch horrible histories because we're reliving our year of four selves but yeah Chris got a little alcoholic beverage but I just got water because I'm driving tomorrow and we've got to be responsible adult so yeah I'm gonna dig in <laughs> I am so sorry you've got angry something that's not Hi guys, I just realised I never actually ended this video. So if you did enjoy it, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. I really exposed my real personality to you in this video. So yeah, make sure you like, subscribe, leave in the comments below other videos you'd like me to do. And I'll see you all very, very soon with a new video. Bye!